What's up, everybody, and welcome to Wrestle Freaking Mania. I'm Josh, that's Tyler. We're coming at you from Orlando, Florida, and it's Wrestle Mania, baby. Tyler, welcome to Wrestle Mania. I'm very happy to be here because, as we all know, I don't care if you're a wrestling fan, I don't care if you're not a wrestling fan. Today, Wrestle Mania, it is the greatest day of the year. I don't care what anybody says. Very, very true, Tyler. And just quickly, I just want to address the, the elephant in the room. Of course, it took us... We took quite a hectic road to get here. Uh, we had to make drastic changes to be able to complete the WWE 2K19 series. But here we are, the culmination of it all, WrestleMania. We're just a few weeks away from WWE 2K20 where we'll hop right into things there. And But that's stuff for another time. It is the culmination of of seven months of storytelling here tonight at WrestleMania. Of course, we had to cut corners, but hey, this has all been one big road to WrestleMania, and nobody said it's easy. No one said it's easy, but we've got a ton of amazing matches coming up for you tonight, including on the Raw side of things, we've got the World Heavyweight Championship on the line. AJ Styles looking to become legendary when he takes on World Heavyweight Champion Alistair Black in what's sure to be an absolute war. Absolutely. AJ Styles getting that Royal Rumble win. He guaranteed he punched his ticket to WrestleMania. It all happens tonight. And of course, on the SmackDown side, Johnny Gargano, he has been chasing and chasing and chasing the WWE Championship since right after SummerSlam of last year. Tonight, he became number one contender for this. He finally has one more shot at this, and he said it himself, this may be his last shot. Johnny Gargano, Dean Ambrose, the WWE Championship, it's on the line tonight. And that is sure to be an absolute banger of a match. But, of course, one big thing we can't ignore on the Raw side of things. The Demon, Finn Balor, is looking to cement his name at the top of WWE in general. But there's one man, there's one man in between him and that goal. And that is the Dead Man, The Undertaker. Turns out, when we saw the Demon first take a loss at Survivor Series, turns out he was attacked by The Undertaker. We saw it happen again at the Royal Rumble, where he lost the World Heavyweight Championship. Again, The Undertaker. The Undertaker has not taken lightly to the Demon, and we'll see what happens between the two here tonight. Who comes out on top, the Demon King or the Phenom? We'll find out here tonight. Of course we will. You got anything else to add, Tom? I'm ready. It's WrestleMania. We are ready, but before we get into your opening matchup, we've got two theme songs here tonight. We're going to tell you about one right now, and that is chosen from the Raw brand. We've got Hail to the King by Avenged Sevenfold. Thank you to Avenged Sevenfold for the amazing song. You can get it on their Hail to the King album, which you can stream live on Spotify. And of course, even though you're not listening to it right now, you will be listening to it later on. For the SmackDown side, we got Dragonfly by Shaman's Harvest. You can get that on their Shine album. You can get it wherever CDs are sold. You can get it on iTunes. And of course, like always, you can stream... Ugh, excuse me. You can... I'm sorry. I'm very <laughs> excited today. Shut up. You can also stream it on Spotify. Now, that being said, let's get into your opening matchup starting right now. Alrighty, kicking it off with the hardcore oh. title on the line. Jeff Hardy defending the hardcore championship against Braun Strowman, and this match is no holds barred. And, oh. and Jeff Hardy. Beautiful reversal. Beautiful reversal on Braun Strowman. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit scared for Hardy here. Does he have what it takes to take on the monster among men? Braun Strowman and looking for a pinfall. One. And no oh. kick out of one. Oof. I would say this is purely Oof. David versus Goliath, but then again, anyone that Braun faces, it's David versus Goliath. You're not wrong. And we'll have to see if Jeff can overcome the odds, but it's not looking great for him right now, and taking out the ref as well. Yeah, like it matters. Oh, 
Braun to the outside now. Braun just having his way. Oh, and he's got a steel chair. Oh. But Jeff Hardy with a baseball slide taking him out. That's Jeff. Oof, on a chair shot right to the head. Taking the big man down. Oh, but oh. Braun Strowman. Oh. Rolling out of the way. What are we going to see here? Oh. Oh, no. And just just strengthen. Ooh, and slamming him down on the chair. That's going to hurt in the morning. And now Strowman with the chair again. Don't do that. Ooh, ah. and right to the back of the head. That's how you cause a concussion. Oh, and what are we about to see here? Ed. And a, ooh, and a snake eyes right on the barricade. You think he should just hand him the hardcore title? I mean, at this point, I, I don't know what to think. Strowman setting up that chair in the corner and now back out of the ring. Ooh, oh. Jeff Hardy running face first into a big boot. And oh no. Oh, it's falling on top of him. Strowman looking to use that announce desk. Oh. Oof, my God. And, oh. And Jeff Hardy with a reversal and oof. Face first. Face first. Right on the ringside. Matt. And now Jeff Matt. Hardy on the ringside Matt. There's Matt's at ringside. Dean. Oh. Oh. And, and oh uh, my god. Braun has this. I don't know. I mean, I think I do know, but. Oh no. no. Don't do it. And a choke oh, slam oh, through oh, the oh. announce table. And you hear the fans chanting, this is awesome. And I think the only person that would disagree with that is probably Jeff Hardy. But, um. Pretty much. Oh, Jeff trying to get back to his feet quickly here. Braun Strowman. Using the steel steps face first. To the forehead of Jeff Hardy. Oh. And now. And it. Oh, ah, God. Slamming him on the apron. Now Braun getting back into the ring. Braun is just taking his time at this point. I mean, it's not like Jeff Hardy's really got any offense in so far. But oh, Jeff looking for an equalizer. The baseball bat. Oof. Oh! Right across the face of Braun Strowman. Got Jeff. Jeff trying to recover here, trying to do anything he can. Oh. Oof. And oh. the strength of Hardy. And Braun landing the back of his head on the bat. And vintage Jeff Hardy right there. And again, landing right on the bat. Jeff going to the top. What's he looking for here? Oh, wait. For a and moonsault. A Ooh, and it connects. Barely missing the steps. One. Two. And no, a kick out <laughs> by Braun Strowman. Jeff thought he had him there. No. Oh. Braun popping right back up. No. Oh. Braun off the ropes and just punching the stairs out of the hands of Jeff Hardy. And you got to think, what Ooh. does Jeff Hardy need to do here to, um, to really get some offense oh. in? But, oh, reversal. Oh. Trying whatever like he, he can. The big man. Oh. And into the corner. Strowman falling down now. Jeff oh. pulling the big man. Jeff. Can he do it? Can he hit it? And a swanton swan bomb. Is and this it? it? To defend the hardcore title here One, at WrestleMania? Two. No. Oh. Strowman kicks out. Jeff wondering what he's got to do here. And back up the ropes yet again. And, and oh, oh, and this time Strowman oh, oh, oh. got the knees up. Oh. And now, oh, oh, no. 
No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh! And almost lying around the steel steps. And oh my god. Telling everyone Jeff's down for the count. Oh, but Strowman's not finished yet. And, no. Ooh, Jeff trying again to get some offense in. This time Strowman going to the outside. Oof. Jeff taking him down. Now Jeff Hardy. Oh. Ooh. And Strowman rolls out of the, out of the way, excuse me. And now Strowman looking for a gut wrench suplex. Yes. Oof. Connecting. Just picking him up like it's nothing. And again, slamming Jeff Hardy right up against the apron. And remember, Jeff has a history of back problems. So Strowman, smart to focus offense on the spine of Jeff Hardy. And Not again. Looking for it again. Not again. On the bat. Oof. Looking for the pinfall. Can this be it for Jeff Hardy? Hit one. Two. No. no. Strowman can't believe it. Jeff's hanging in there, but how much? And Strowman now getting into an altercation with the ref. Oh. Oh, and oh. Jeff Hardy. Braun didn't see him. And now... Twist of fate. Twist of fate uh, connects. Oh, oh, oh. Pulling the big man. Can this be it for Braun Strowman here at Mania up to the top yet again? One more Swanton Bomb. Swanton yes. Bomb. Is it? Is it it for Jeff One, Hardy? Two. Oh. And Braun kicks out again. And what the hell is it going to take? Whoa. Jeff going back up to the top. And this Braun time. Is getting up. Calling for Strowman to get up. And. Oof. Oh. And taking the big man down yet again. And third time's the charm. Jeff thinks from the top. He wants it again. Calling for him to get up again. And. Oof. Can he keep the big man down? One, two. No. Oh. Braun Strowman still able to kick out. Jeff looking like he's seen a ghost. Oh. Oh. No. Oof, oh. and driving the sledgehammer right into the gut of Jeff Hardy. And now Braun looking to use the hammer. Hammering it right into the gut of Hardy. Now. What's he doing? And then running oh! power slam. Just scraping the stairs. And now what are we going to see? Braun, don't do this. And, oh, oh my god <laughs> and Jeff just rolling out writhing in pain oh but he's got oh. the bat that punch barely phasing Strowman oof and another clothesline from Strowman oh, oh but Hardy with the reversal and Twist of fate again on the outside of the ring. But Kenny dragged the big man inside. Picking him up. There he goes in the ring. Hardy. Up to the apron. And oh. Now just picking up the pieces. What's he thinking? Oh. And, and a running oh, power slam landing right on the baseball bat. One, two, two three. three. Braun Strowman, your new hardcore 
champion, and what a way to start off WrestleMania. Good luck to anybody trying to take the title from him. That's a, that's a good point, Tyler. That's a good point. And Hardy did just about everything he could. Chair shots, baseball bat to the face multiple times, steel steps, three swanton bombs, two, three twist of fates. None of it phased Braun. Nope. So with that being said, let's move on to your next match, starting right now. Alrighty, now some SmackDown Ooh. action. We've got a ladder match between Ooh. Ty Dillinger and the Velveteen Dream for the Intercontinental Championship. Ooh. And Ty Dillinger. Ooh. 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 The powerful super kick. Den. Oh, but Velveteen Dream not having any of it with a scoop slam. Now heading up to the top. And, and, oh, oh, the power of Ty Dillinger. Just grabbing the Dream oh. out of midair and tossing him aside. Oof. Oh. Now into the corner. And... Oof. Beautiful drop kick. Fans with these damn signs here. Now off the ropes. Oh, double team running right by him. Oof. And a big chop. And... Oh. 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 And, 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 and a no! suplex to ringside. The strength of Velveteen Dream. Lengths that these two are going to go oof. through for the Intercontinental Championship. It's understandable. One of the most prestigious titles in the history of the WWE. Oh. And oof. No. And again, Velveteen Dream missing from the top rope and Ty Dillinger retaliating with a Russian leg sweep. Now Ty getting the ladder. And goes... Oh. Oh, and, but. And, ooh. oh! And it's grazing the side of the ladder. Into the corner. Now, what is this? And. Oof! Sunset flip power bomb. Beautiful. Oof! And a little clothesline from hell. Velveteen rolling out. Now, Dillinger yeah. setting up the ladder. Ty Dillinger setting up the ladder. Ty Dillinger going for the title already, but here comes the dream. And, oh. Punches to the gut. Oh. Oof. Smashing his head off the ladder. No. Reversal, though, by Ty. Oh. And, Reversal oh. again. Oh! And again with the reversals. Tied. Oh, these two going down. Oh! Ooh! Ooh. Beautiful kick of set own. of kicks. Now middle rope, Velveteen Dream. Oof! Elbow to the face. And what's Velveteen Dream looking for here? Another ladder. Ladders are they going for? And no. Oof. Now, is he going for another ladder? How many ladders do we need, guys? Oh no. Oh no, you're right, Tyler. What are they doing? Oh. Setting that one in the ring, though. Oh, oh but again! No! That time, spine first onto the ladder. Ty Dillinger saying, come get some. Oh. Oh, but Velveteen Dream is planning on it. Oof. Knocking him right down. Oh, Velveteen Dream. And, and a big oh! splash to the outside. 
They are that desperate to get that championship. And oof. And a it's snake smooth. eyes right on that ladder. Rolling him up for something. And oof. Oh. Reversal by Ty. Oh. What are we going to see? Bring so him sending him careening into that ladder. Snake and eyes of his own. Snake eyes of his own. Dead. Calling for the 10 yet again. I'm a poet and I didn't know it. Oh. Oof, but a big clothesline from Velveteen Dream. Picking him back up. Right Oof. to the ladder. We take. Oh. Well, damn. I don't really know what we're seeing. Oh, oh my oh. god! Cameraman was too close. And a power bomb right through that ladder. Damn camera people. Setting up the ladder outside the ring, not sure what for. And Ooh. Oof. And what's Velveteen Dream thinking here? Uh. Well, I no. guess not thinking anything. Having second thoughts. Having um, second thoughts. Having second thoughts. Going back down, but oh. Ty Dillinger, big knee to the face. Nope. Having second thoughts, too. And. Oof. Oh. Went for something. Velveteen oh. Dream quick up the ladder. Ty Dillinger right behind him, though. Oh. Taking his shots. Oof. Velveteen Dream finally lets go of the title. And now he's reeling. Uh, Ooh, and there he goes. Oh. Is this Ty Dillinger's chance? He's going for it. Velveteen's starting to get up. Starting to realize it. And, oh. Oh, I'm pushing the ladder oh. down. Oh. Oof. Little elbow action. Oh. And what are we going to see here? And oof, Hanging getting hung up ropes. right on the ropes. Oh. What does Velveteen Dream have in mind? Yeah. Oof, Ooh. big knee to the gut. And big drop kick into the corner. Now Dillinger. Awesome. Oof. What is this? Oh. Oh. Ooh, oh! Scoop slam right through the ladder. A little retaliation for that power bomb. No, not this. And what are we gonna see? Ooh, my God! Oh. I think the dream's busted. The dream is busted wide open, and this dream is quickly turning into a nightmare for the Velveteen Dream. Oh, but Ty Dillinger. He's thinking something. Not sure what he's thinking, but he's thinking something for sure. Getting another ladder. Oh! Drop kick. Drop kick and the back of Velveteen's head bouncing off of that ladder and you see him rolling out now. And oh! Oh, maybe he beat it out, Tyler. Or not Tyler, Ty Dillinger. I was thinking Tyler Bate for some reason. Wrong person. I know, I know. And oh! Oof! Into the announce desk. Oh. Oof, and that oh. running knee. Oh, they just got a new table. It's got a new table out here, but I gotta destroy this one. Velveteen getting up. But not for long, Ty Dillinger. Dragging him over to the table. Now. Yeah. And what are we seeing here? Just setting him on there. Ty Dillinger rolls in the ring. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, what the hell is this going to be? And, and a diving oh! elbow drop puts him through the announce desk. Ty Dillinger saying it's over. 
and saying that that was a perfect 10. But oh, might not be that, that over considering Velveteen Dream is just crawling towards the ring now. And now, oh. Oh, but he doesn't see the dream. Well, maybe he does. Uh, the oh! dream drop kicks the ladder down. A scoop slam. Scoop slam. Now, to the top rope. And, and ooh, oh. a big splash. And up to the rope again. What are we going to see? This. And oh! oh! And driving his elbow straight into the ladder. Went for the purple rainmaker, but... Oh, are we going to see it again? And there it is! He missed the purple rainmaker, and that's going to haunt him. And... Oof. Oh, oh, and his head hitting the ladder! And his head bouncing back off the ladder again. Velveteen Dream is seriously hurt here. And is that enough for Ty Dillinger to take the title... Here, here comes the oh. dream. And oh. Oh. Big right hands. No. Oh. Dillinger is woozy. And now dream. Looking for it. And oh. oh. Punch to the gut. He's all he almost has it. Which one of these men is gonna get and, it? And Ty oh! Dillinger throws him down again. And is this it? He's got it! Ty Dillinger! Yes! He's got it! The Intercontinental Champion, Ty Dillinger. Making a WrestleMania moment for sure. That's not the first time we've seen the Intercontinental Championship defended in a ladder match at WrestleMania. I have a feeling it won't be the last. And now the Intercontinental Champion is a perfect 10. You're not wrong. We've got a monstrous hardcore champion, the perfect 10 Intercontinental Champion. What else are we going to see tonight? Who knows? But what I do know, Tyler, is up next. We've got triple threat women's action for the Raw Women's Championship. It comes... Full circle here tonight. Kyrie Sane defends her Raw Women's Championship against Alexa Bliss and Ember Moon, a triple threat, and that match is next. All right. Raw Women's Championship on the line. Like I said before, it comes full circle here tonight. Kyrie Sane defends the Raw Women's Championship that she won seven months ago in this exact same matchup. Alexa Bliss and Ember Moon. We're going to capture that raw women's gold. Pimpa. Kyrie Sane looking for a, for a roll up, but no, Alexa Bliss kicks out of one. Oof. Oh. Now Ember Moon looking for a piece of Kyrie Sane. And a big suplex. Oh. And snapping the neck of Alexa Bliss. Oh. And Ember Moon. Aggressive out the gate here. Oof. Snap suplex. She knows what's on the line. She has failed oh. in two attempts already to win the Raw Women's Championship. Of course, this oh. is the match we saw seven months ago at Armageddon. Where Ember Moon lost. Kyrie Sane making her debut from NXT that night and winning the Raw Women's Championship. And then the next month... Losing now, oh, again in a singles match to Kyrie Sane. Will tonight finally be the night that Kyrie loses the title? It's a good question. She's held it seven months straight ever since her debut on the main roster. And I still say that title belongs to oof. Alexa. Just saying. Well, you know what, Tyler? I think you're the only one that still hung up on that. But oof! Oh, and a power no. slam by Ember Moon. I'm not. Mm, I think, pretty sure you are. Now, nope. everybody agrees that Alexa should still be champion. And Ember Moon, knee across the throat of Alexa Bliss, looking for the pin. And Kyrie Sane breaking it up. Oh, oof. pin foul. What? And the match, no, kick out of one. Oof. Ooh. Big old drop kick. 
Forearm to the face. And a stare down and oof. Drop kick from Alexa. Oh, back suplex from Alexa, but Ember Moon. I appreciate, Ember Moon. I appreciate the oof. Riddler outfit that Alexa has. She can riddle me anytime. Oh, God damn it, Tyler. What? What? Oh. Ooh, and a spear oh. from Kyrie Sane. What'd I say? Just focus on the match, please. And focus on Alexa. Oh. Oof, when that spinning backhand to the back of the head. And is that a knockout? Is this a win? No. And Alexa comes sliding back in. Trying to... Oof. Oh, is that... Trying to clean up the table scraps, if you will. Oof. Oh, but now Kyrie Sane. Roll up. Oh. Ooh. Oh, Roll hello. up in a bridge. That's a beautiful That's position. It. No. Ember Moon now rolling out. Now it's just Kyrie and Alexa. This is a familiar sight that we've seen as well. And a diving spear into the corner. Eh. And oof. Kyrie. Kyrie Dragging putting her. Alexa center of the ring. Now. Go for the insane elbow. Yes. Now pinfall. Oh, but One. Ember Moon. Two. And. Oh. oh. And I think she got Alexa there. But Kyrie Sane. I think she saw that coming, oh. but a big drop kick. Now Kyrie Sane rolling out. Ember Moon. She just picking up the pieces here. Is she gonna hit Total Eclipse? And, and the yes! Eclipse! There it is! Can this be it for Ember Moon? One, two, that's it! And just like that, Ember Moon picks up the victory, and you see Kyrie Sane's not happy. But Ember Moon is ecstatic. And most importantly, she is your new Raw Women's Champion. It looks like I'm really going to have to cheer up Alexa tonight. <sighs> God damn it, Tyler. Kyrie could be there, too. What? What? What'd I say? Something I said? No, oh, yeah, it was something you said, Tyler. It was something you said. Hey, congratulations. There's a couple to things you said. Congratulations to Ember Moon, but I got I to gotta cheer up Kyrie and Alexa. What? You know what'll cheer me up, Tyler? What? If we get to the next match. Never. Your next match starts right now. All right, the sun is setting here on WrestleMania, but we've got many more matches to go, oh. including this one, Pete Dunne. Taking on Drew McIntyre for the European Championship. I think it's very fitting here. Oh, McIntyre moving. Yep, both of these guys from, of course, Europe. More specifically, both of them from the UK. But still. Pinfall. Now Drew looking for a quick pinfall. No. Oof. Uh. Oh. Oof. McIntyre has been dominant for the longest time now. Especially after winning the European Oof. Championship, having numerous, countless title defenses. Very, very true. But can he defend himself against the bruiserweight, Pete Dunne? Former UK champion. Oh. And of course, this match is no oh. holds barred. But Drew McIntyre not looking to take it. Oh. A sledgehammer to the gut anytime soon. Oh, oof, but he's going to go face first right into the ring post. And now Pete done with the sledgehammer again. Stop. Hammer time. And ooh, ooh, right to the gut. And almost throwing that sledgehammer down right on top of Drew McIntyre's head. And oof. Another shot. You can see Drew McIntyre already in immense pain here. Oh. Oh. But Drew McIntyre looking to retaliate. 
Man, no! Oof! Is Pete done the answer to stop Drew McIntyre? I mean, that's a that's a good question. Oh. Oh. Pete done with the chairs. Oh. Drew McIntyre with the hammer. And, oh. oh, missing, but oof! Running right into the steel steps. Pete done just being dominating here. And he's got the nickname the Bruiserweight for a reason. In the steps they go. Oh. Whoa. McIntyre. And, oof. Oh. McIntyre up to the middle rope. Oof. Oh. Elbow right to the chest. And stops to the midsection. And, and oof. Oh. No, 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 oh, Just grazing that bottom step on the steel steps. Now going for the pinfall. Looking for the pin yet again. Do we have a new champion? No. Kick out of two. And that was almost it. Pete Dunn has almost slain the Scottish psychopath here tonight. Oh. But I don't think McIntyre's anywhere close to giving up. No, he is not. <laughs> Now, and oof, Whoa. sending him right into the steel steps. Oh, uh, no, uh, we saw this earlier tonight. And, oh, oh, Pete Dunn rolling through. Sunset flip. Sunset one. flip into a pinfall. No. And kick out at one by McIntyre. Beautiful Whoa. counter there by Pete Dunn. And, to, Oof. Oh. He saw he was in trouble, and he did what he had to do to get out. And no. Oh, and again. Oh, what oh. are we going to see? We got that suplex. And Oof. Oh. Just letting go of him in midair. One. Is that it? Two. No. no. Kick out again. Done going back to the outside. Oh, steel chair in hand, though. Oh, oh my God. And what they are we going to see? They don't call him the bruiser away for nothing. You got that right. And, oh. I thought he was going to drop him right on that chair. McIntyre oh. doing the smart thing, trying to take a breather here. And, Oof. Oh, just running him down. Just baiting Pete Dunn to the outside. No. What is this? And, and, ooh. Oh! That bottom step. Oh, and what are we going to see now? Stomping a mud hole in him. Oh. White noise. Ooh. Ah! Little props to Seamus there. Oh, no. McIntyre. No, 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 no. Oh! And spear right through the barricade. <laughs> and you hear the fans. This is awesome. These two are ready to go to war for that championship. McIntyre getting in the ring. He's got the chair. Dunn finally getting up. And Pete Dunn, I don't know if he realizes. McIntyre's got the chair right behind him. Ooh. Ooh, now he does. Oh, yeah, he sure does now. I'm just dragging him. Dragging Pete Dunn back to the ring. To the inside. Oof. And a big boot ah. right to the side of the head. McIntyre coming back with the steel chair. Contemplating what to do next. No. Oh. He's up. Oh. Oof. Running fist into the corner. Uh. Drew McIntyre telling him it's over. And. Oh. 
Oh, no. And, and face oh. first into the steel chair. McIntyre calling for something. And look at that white noise yet again inside the ring this time. Can it be it for the bruiser weight? And could it be out. One, two. No. no. And that was almost it. That was almost a successful title defense. And you see the Scottish psychopath manically pacing in the ring, figuring out what he has to do. Can he keep the bruiser weight down? Oh. oh. Think and maybe. Oof. oof. Thought maybe McIntyre was looking for the Claymore kick there, but. Now. Back in the ring. Get the chair. S steel chair in hand. What is. Oh, no. No, no, no. It's not worth it. Pete Dunne thinks it's worth it. Ooh, oh, my God. Just closing that chair right around the neck. Right around the throat of Drew McIntyre. Can he even breathe? I don't think so. And I'm going to see it yet again. There it is. Be done with that smug look. Oh, he's not done. No pun intended. Oof. Looking for it. Bitter end. Bitter end. Yes. Now he's done. Pun intended. One. Two. two. No. Oh. Damn it, I was wrong. You're always wrong. I thought he was done. Pun intended. Anyway. And, oh. oh. A big bicycle kick. Oh, oh! The Scottish oh. Psychopath with a kip up! Is he going no. for the Claymore? Setting up for the Claymore. And. Oh! No. And just tossing him out of the way. And now. And for the third time. And yes! Yes! Dropping that suplex. And now. Bitter a end. Forearm. I'm and calling it. Now he's yes. done! Pun intended. Wait, what's Dunn? Damn it, I was wrong again. Dunn just dragging him. Oh, wait. Oh. He's gonna do it one more time. And a second. Third. Well, second in a row. Bitter end. And now, one, two. Now he's done. Pete Dunn, your new European champion. It took three better ends to keep McIntyre down. It's pretty ironic considering the word end is in the name, but you know, I'll let it slide. But with that being said, the bruiser weight with an impressive, impressive victory here tonight. Pete Dunne having his WrestleMania moment here tonight. And an impressive thing considering he only debuted on the main roster a few months ago. And now he's the European champion. Now he walks out of WrestleMania of all places, the European champion. Very fitting. Very, very fitting indeed. But, Tyler, from one title match to the next, we've got a fatal four-way tag team ladder match. Four teams looking for the Raw Tag Team Championship. Specifically, three teams looking to dethrone the club. Gallows and Anderson defend against the Usos, against the authors of Pain, Tyler, and against Sanity. This is going to be insane. It's going to be insane. Let's get to it, starting right now. All righty, eight man, te well, technically four teams, eight men, all looking for the Raw Tag Team Championship suspended high above the ring. Oof. First team to grab them will be your new champions. Of course, we've got, oof, 
The Club defending their titles here tonight against the Usos, the Authors of Pain and Sanity. And we'll see if Gallows and Anderson can get it done here tonight. I'm predicting the tag team will win. Oh, that's a good prediction. Thought of it myself. I'm proud of you, Tyler. Thank you. I really am. And, oof, there's so much action going on, I don't even know what to commentate. But in the ring right now is Eric Young, Luke Gallows, and, oof, Jimmy Uso. All taking Jimmy? turns. Uh, it's one of the Usos. It's, you know, I got a 50-50 shot at figuring it out. Okay, oof. Dana almost going through the table. Now both Usos in the ring. Jimmy using that ladder against Luke Gallows. And, oof, Luke Gallows rolling out of the way this time. Oh. And, oof, oh, my God. Oof. So much anarchy going around right now. And, oof. Six, now seven men in the ring. Killian Dane now. Oof. Oh. Oof. Oh. And, oof, there goes the ladder. And slam. Now Gallows and Dane on the outside. Oh. Oof. Oh. Oof. Now Gallows and Jimmy Uso on the outside. And oof. Big man Luke Gallows getting a ladder. I believe that's Akam getting a ladder. Uh, two ladders in the ring now. Oh. Oh. It's just anarchy right now. That's what I said. You know, you said it before, I'll, I'll say it again, you know? How Oof. could you say it again when I'm the one who said it? In order to say something again, you had to have said it first, but you didn't. All I right. did. You know what, Tyler? You want to quit with the technicalities? It's supposed to be a fun night here. We're here at Wrestle Freaking Mania of all places. My Christmas. My Christmas. You don't celebrate Christmas. This is different. This is a Christmas worth celebrating. While Oof. the while the only December holiday that I celebrate is Festivus, I stand by what I say. And besides, this can happen in March or April. So this can be my Christmas that I actually celebrate. Well, I'm happy for you, Tyler, but there's just so goddamn much going on inside the ring that I do not know what to commentate, so. Gallows now, look, going after Jey Uso. Oh. And oof. Killian Dane just tossing it. Oh my god, and I think ah. Killian Dane's busted open. Went in right on the edge of that ladder. Now Luke Gallows. And oh. oof. Now Luke Gallows climbing up the ladder by himself right now. Here comes Anderson, trying to protect him maybe. Oh, not doing a oh. fantastic job though. Killian Dane. Oof, knocking Luke Gallows right off the ladder. Now Akum, the big man going up. Now Akum, oh, oh well, never mind. Coming back down. And they're gone. Just absolute anarchy. Gallows and Eric Young laid out on top of each other. Oh. Anderson and Razor getting just beat to hell in the ring right now. Oh, the super kick. Gallows back in the ring. And taking it to Killian Dane. Carl's got the ladder. And now the club are the only two standing in the ring. Well, now Killian Dane standing, but oh, and a big spine buster to Killian Dane. Akam starting to get up. And Gallows doesn't have that set up in the right spot. Oof. And, oh. Oh, just dropping him. And now Anderson and oof. 
Anderson is just a one-man wrecking crew in that ring right now. Oof. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, get rid of the ladder. Toss it on to Eric Young. Oh. oh, Anderson was looking for the cutter there, but... Take him reversing. Oh. Gallows again with the ladder. Oh. Oof. Now setting it up off center here. Not sure that's what he wanted to do. Yeah. Setting up center now. He believes everyone's distracted or down. Can the authors of pain do it? Oh. Here comes Gallows. Oh, no, oh, never mind. Jimmy oh. pushing over the ladder. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. Oof. Luke Gallows choke slam on top of the ladder on the outside. Oh. And. Oof. Sidewalk slam on the outside from Gallows. Now. Carl getting tossed out. Luke Gallows though sneaking in. Hinkum don't even realize it. Can he get it? Eric Young realizes, though. Oh. Oh. It's gonna happen. Pushing the ladder. Oh. 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 Razor grabbed him, but is it too late? Trying to get him. And no. And there comes. Oof. Big man goes down. And those titles are close to coming unhinged. Oh. Gallows pulling himself up. Taking the ladder oh. off Eric Young. Now. Oof. Oh. Taking everyone out in the ring. Is this the opportunity for Luke Gallows? Oh. But here comes Eric Young. Take him doing. Ooh. Whoa. Luke Gallows up again. Carl yep. Anderson oh. coming in. Stopping Akum. He makes the save. Is this it? Can the club retain the tag titles? I think he's got them. They do. The save by Anderson calls it a match. And with all champions advantage thrown out the window with all odds put against them the club still come out of wrestlemania raw tag team champions they got their titles still and what an impressive showing out of this team especially from luke gallows he was like a bulldozer in that ring just wrecking shop left and right and, like I said, I'm impressed. And I hope we don't get a cease and desist for this, but I guess you could say that Wayne was too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet. But that being said, we've got more matches coming up next. All right, Daniel Bryan and The Miz. Oh! This match we've been waiting for. And what are we going to see out of the Miz? And, oh, no. Daniel Bryan with a reversal. Oh. Oh. Yes lock. Can he get it locked in? The yes lock. Miz was saying he was going to embarrass Bryan, but could it be the other way around? And that's, that's it. That's it. The, <laughs> the Miz taps out in a matter of seconds to the yes lock. And just like that, Daniel Bryan gets yet another WrestleMania moment under his belt. This time, finally shutting up. The Miz. After all this time, Miz saying he will embarrass Daniel Bryan once and for all at Mania. It happened, but it was the other way around. 
Daniel Bryan embarrassing the Miz here tonight. And you hear how much the crowd loves that result. The yes movement continues. The yes movement is stronger than ever. But, with that being said, Tyler, we got one half of Mania in the books. Six of 12 matches down. Six more to go. But, with that being said, to make things easier on the audience, we're gonna... We're gonna cut it here. This will be episode one, part one of WrestleMania. We'll be back for part two very, very soon. Yes, we will. But with that being said, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to part one of WrestleMania. You can't miss part two. Be sure to tune in. And until next time, we'll see you in the second half of Mania. We will.